how you guys doing welcome back to the channel once again i'm hoping you're having a great day today and everything you try to accomplish this year it becomes into reality welcome back to the channel i hope you guys are doing okay today finally today finally the day is here i'm going to be installing a front bash bar on my 370c also i got some stealing long cold air intakes and uh this is what this video is about i hope you guys enjoy today's content brought to you by highlight tuners check it out very nice it's a tff bash bar i think it stands for true focus fabrication something like that and i also got the long to fill in cold air intake so, yeah that's what we're gonna install today please if you're if you're here for the first time viewing this channel don't be a hater all your life hit that subscribe button turn post notification like this video it helps the channel a lot Please help your boy out. I'm trying to make this channel as successful as I can. And I can't do it if you guys don't subscribe. So if you're watching this, it only takes a few seconds to hit that subscribe button. You won't regret it. I'm going to keep uh, content coming up all the time about my three cars. I got a Toyota Tacoma, 370, and a 1964 Chevy Impala. And with that being said, let's get to the video. Okay, so I want to explain something to you guys about the cold air intakes. They're made by Stillen. Now, however, because I know I'm going to ask, I know you guys are going to ask me this question, so I'm going to answer them for you. Do you have to get the cartoon after you put this cold air intakes? Yes, you do. You got to have your cartoon because you want to get the full potential out of this cold, cold air intake. The car and the computer will respond differently if you put cold air intake. Your whole car is going to be different. Now, I'm going to show you something. I have short intakes. These, you don't need to get your cartoon. These are just as normal as the ones that you have. You may gain maybe 5 to 10 horsepower maximum i think this ones are about 25 i'm not sure uh leave me a message down below and correct me if i'm wrong anyways so that's what's going to happen with this cold air intake you're going to have to get your cartoon to get the best out of them now i'm going to go ahead and start doing the process i'm going to do a time lapse it's real simple to do all you got to do is remove the front bumper take the whole cold air take the cold air intakes out and put the new one in and uh and another another um thing that i'm gonna tell you if you're going to turbo your car you don't need to buy these this is just gonna be a waste of money for you you don't need them because the turbo piping will basically take all, all over this so am i gonna turbo my car in the future i really don't know because i'm trying to avoid putting more money into the car because i already got a lot of money into the car so when i sell it I don't have to lose a lot of my money but i hope this information is helping you if you're a 370 junkie man do me a favor man hit that subscribe button man help your boy grow man come on let's do it let's get it anyways we're here at my shop it's early in the morning we're slow right now because yesterday we were slammed and i said hey let me do it today because the new owner of the short cold air intakes is coming to pick it up today so i gotta get them out today so i gotta put this on and I'm going to show you the process. I'm gonna shoot some time lapse, okay? So I hope you guys enjoy the video. And do me a favor, like I said, just hit the subscribe button. Help your bro go all the way to 4,000, 5,000 subscribers. As a matter of fact, we are about to hit the 4,000 subscribers mark. And I wanna thank each and one of you that subscribe to the channel. I really appreciate your love, your help, your support. I try to, I try to answer all your, all your messages, all your questions. And um, I'm going to leave my Instagram down in the description below so y'all can follow me. I'm going to make it public so you don't have to wait for me to approve you or anything. 
just please be patient with me. You know that I'm a busy man and I got a lot of things to do right now. All right? All right, then let's get to it. So, to start with the installation, the bumper has to come out. And of course, the short intakes. I hope I don't have to take the the bar. Damn, it looks like it's gonna be a heck of a work. And then I already put the the splash shield in the bottom. That has to come out too. The bumper has to come out for us to install the new bash bar slash cold air intake. So yeah, I'm gonna put you guys on time lapse. You guys just saw me take the bumper out. It's really straightforward. Just take the pins from the top of the bumper and then you have some bolts in the bottom from your splash shield and it comes right out. There you go. And for the ones that have been asking me, how is this body kit holding on? It's holding on pretty good. I've been having it for a, uh, about a year now, a year and some months. And it's, it's, I mean, it's worth it. For the money that you're paying for, it's worth it. I would definitely buy it again if I needed to. But the bumper has been holding up good. I've been holding some low spots here and there. Uh, let me show you, like right there, you see the scrape right there? That's that's all that happened to it. Am I happy? No, because who wants to mess up their bumper? I know I don't, but yeah, Nismo B1 bumper. Check it out, it's still intact. Okay. And as you guys know, I already put my bash bar. This bash bar is from uh, I think the company's called TFF, TFF True Focus Fabrication, and the price in one of these right now I think it's like 600 bucks, and uh, it's actually pretty good. So I was telling you guys that I'm gonna have to cut a little bit from the radiator support because if you guys notice, hold on, if you guys notice, hang on a second, let me let me lower the camera down. Okay, there you go. The holes right here, that's where you're gonna have to be cutting. It's not, it's not uh, wide enough for the tube to slide forward. So that's what I'm gonna be doing right now. I'm gonna go ahead and cut those. However, I brought my camera today. It doesn't have a lot of uh, battery left. So I'm gonna do the work and then I'm gonna show you guys. All right then. you guys so I finished already with one side I'm going to show you how much that I grind so that way you guys don't make the same mistake I did if you guys can see right here I grinded a little bit too much look look see that but nobody's gonna see this so if you fuck up or you mess up don't worry about it you know what I'm saying because the bumper goes in here and nobody's gonna really see it only you you you're the only one that's gonna know but take your time just grind just a little bit you don't need to grind a whole lot and also the headlight has to come out. The headlight is on the way, so it has to come out. And uh, this is where I'm at. I'm already done with one side. And also the map sensor, you know, two bolts comes right out, put it on the new one, and you're good. This is our still in uh, cold air intakes. Um, I suppose to gain more horsepower, I won't be able to tell you until I actually test it. When I get on the highway, when I do zero to 100, you know how it is, you know, we. We be trying to be just nice sound, nice exhaust system. But uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoy today's content. If you're new to the channel, like I said, please subscribe, man. Show your support, your love for your fellow 370C Nismo owner, you know. Just show love, man, you know what I'm saying? And I wanna tell to all my subscribers, thank you for subscribing. Thank you to each one of you. It's 4,000 of y'all, I can't thank you guys enough. Thank you for the support. Thank you for all the good feedback, all the good comments. Even the dumb comments, I still show you love. 
And even if you don't subscribe, man, I got love for you, man. You know what I'm saying? Because my channel is nothing but love and good vibes. That's all it is. And uh, if you guys enjoyed this content, please give it a thumbs up. Leave comments down below. Let me know where you're tapping in from. Let me know how you're doing. How's everything going? Where your 370 looks like. And I hope you guys enjoyed today's content. Until then, I'll see you guys on the next one. I'm out. Peace. Much love. Thank you for watching.